And the Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office has made its first arrest in the investigation of the death of 15-year-old Kawan Bobby Charles. News 15's Princess Jeanne Steverson Lowry tells us who the Sheriff's Office has arrested and what members of the Charles' family had to say about it. It's been just over three months since the body of 15 year old Kawan Bobby Charles was found in a drainage ditch and a sugarcane field. His body nude and his face disfigured. And now the Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office has made their first arrest in his death. The Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office arresting 37 year old Janet Irvin, allegedly one of the last people to see Charles alive. Kawan's family has been very vocal about suspecting Irvin as the number one suspect in what they believe to be Kawan's murder. One family member expressed joy over the arrest. Thank God for um, Stan Black, um, for our attorneys. Thank God for everybody. Thank God for everybody that helped out. Thank God for all the shares. Thank God for all the pressure. Thank God for everything. She has been arrested. Today is the day where we start. On Monday, shortly after Irvin was arrested, Iberia Parish Sheriff Tommy Ramiro released this update. The Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office Bureau of Investigations made an arrest in the Kawan Charles case. Janet Irvin was booked into the Iberia Parish Jail on the following charges. Felony charge of failure to report a missing child and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. The family of Kawan says the arrest is just a start when it comes to getting justice. They want more charges brought and more importantly, they want convictions. It's been a long three months, you know, and um, it's been uh, a bunch of turmoil, you know, it's been a bunch of stress, a bunch of crying, a bunch of ups, a bunch of downs, you know, um, she's been arrested. Earlier today, Irvin was given a bond set at $400,000, $300 on failure to report a missing child and $100 on contributing to the delinquency of a minor. I did try and reach out to the family attorney. I was not able to get a response at this time. In Lafayette, I'm Princess Jeanne Steverson Lowry, News 15. Thanks so much, Princess. And Sheriff Romero would like to make it clear that all the evidence that's led to the arrest of Janet Irvin was made by the Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office and not by relying on any private investigator's findings.